Hey guys, welcome back to Minecraft. It's another adventure map time. Woo! Today we're playing Saving the Cosmos by Degroot69 and Redalex, I'm gonna go with. Or Red Red Alex, maybe. I don't know, a couple of ways of pronouncing that. Um yeah, it plays like Mario Galaxy or Mario 64, whatever one you've got like kind of a hub and then branches coming off, or at least that's what I've been told anyway. Let's read this book and see what the hell's going on here. I've got 34 levels, that's pretty cool. Welcome to Saving the Cosmos! There are some rules you will need to follow. There's there's always rules. I bet one of them's gonna be have fun. Uh, do not break blocks, do not give yourself weapons, you will not need food. Stay in adventure mode. I may or may not be in adventure mode at the moment. I haven't set stuff. Uh, if you are stuck on a puzzle, feel free to fly over it using game mode 1. I will do my best not to do that, but as they have given me the option, uh, I don't know, we'll call a time limit on each puzzle, <laughs> I think. Uh, but remember to go back into adventure mode afterwards, yeah, that's cool. Uh, bosses in this map must be beaten legit. If you die against the boss, you will have to restart the fight. Okay, this means you will have to be very tactical in the way you fight, that's fine, I am a tactical player. This map is not finished, that's alright, like, he doesn't actually seem to be doing too much to update it so let's go with this and see what happens we've read the book uh let's press the button chapter one the jury all right well i'm stuck here uh order order court is now in session uh harold carrington Rayliff, neighbor of the defendant glenn michael carmwell has made an accusation of witchcraft aimed at the defendant defendant do you plead guilty or not guilty not guilty, Your Honour. This is tr not true. I am practiced Christian, and I will never betray the Lord with magic. My home is clean. There are no traces of black magic anywhere, Gov. Uh, plaintiff, what do you have to say about these remarks? <coughs> Your Honour, I have seen it. He is opening portals all around his house. It's not true. It's not true. I have no proof. You have no proof. Plaintiff, do you have any proof of your claims? Order. Order. <laughs> I do not have any uh, any visual evidence, but I have seen him change his form, tearing holes in space. He has open portals and other dimensions. Defendant, do you claim these claims? Uh, I do not, Your Honor. My home has been lived in for generations. I will never disfigure it with something as dark, ma dark as evil as black magic. Your Honor, Glenn has changed forms too. I have seen it. He can conjure fireballs. He dabbles in witchcraft. Your Honor, I swear on an oath. I never lie outright to anyone. I am not guilty. It's true. You can take the form of the end deity. The, what, the, the dragon? This is a lie. I despise magic. It ruined all my family and it killed my children. You killed your children. <coughs> I don't know if that gasp was loud enough. You also killed my children. Well, okay, I can see why he's a bit annoyed. Uh, what? Uh, what? I never went anywhere. No, I never even touched your children. Order, order. Plaintiff, please confirm you were, uh, where your children were killed by the defendant. Your Honor. No, that's the chaste his voice. Your Honor, my children are always fascinated with Glenn's courtyard. They say it fascinated them. Because it's fascinating. One day, they said they saw Glenn rip a hole in the air. What well, of that. And I told them never to go near Glenn's house ever again. Ever. But they didn't listen. Two days ago, I went to his yard. They never came back. They went into his yard. Sorry, I didn't. I never went anywhere. That would be trespassing, and I am a uh, upstanding member of society. So I sued Glenn, and here we are now. Your Honor, this is outrageous. He's trying to frame me. You killed them. I would never hurt children. <laughs> I saw them in your basement. I went looking for them. I saw them in the window of your basement. You are there. You are taking the form of the end deity. It wasn't me. I saw your kids. They were in my garden, so I simply told them to get out. I don't know where they are. They went after that. Silence! <laughs> if, the plaintiff, uh, if the plaintiff does not con uh, present any liable evidence, this session is now concluded. Do, do, do. Do you possess any liable evidence? <coughs> no, but... Then I pronounce the defendant... Not guilty. Yes? No, no, sorry, no, no, he will kill me. You may leave, Glenn. <laughs> Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you. Stop, no, stop. No, my kids, no. That is all. Please leave. Bye. Are they going to let me out now? I've been kind of stood here for a long time now. Uh, it would be greatly appreciated if anyone could leave the courtroom. I, I want to. Let me go. 
Let me go. God, we've been sat here for like nearly five minutes now. Oh, 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 I said, oh, oh, I feel ill. What? What's happening here? What? Why is there redstone in the ceiling? Why is that? Oh, is this gonna, is this gonna wear off? No, we're all good. So, uh, we didn't get any names, but someone reckons someone's killed their kids. We're using magic. Now, I, I don't know. That guy sounded kind of legit to me. The, the, no, I didn't do it. Don't like them. Uh, he sounded good, but the other guy sounded pretty evil. Oh, chapter two. No, no, 555. Five, five. Hello, my name is Morbid Zenith. That's a funny name. Please do not be alarmed. We sedated you so we could bring you here. You what? Don't be alarmed when you drugged me and kidnapped me. Oh, this is headquarters of the Secret Suspicion Society, or S S S S. Here we spy on those who are suspected of being extremely dangerous. It's not me, Garth. I didn't do nothing. I mean, the police cleared me of all charges. Uh, we have brought you here because we are in need of your abilities. My abilities? We need you to stop Glenn. But Glenn's alright. Glenn's fine. He, he speaks like this. How can he be anything but fine? We know about Glenn and how he's associated with witchcraft. Is he? Is he really? He sounded legit to me. Oh, oh. Oh, uh, sorry. <laughs> Didn't realise you were just going to repeat it at me again. Uh, I am obviously mistaken. This is why we let Glenn in the, win the court battle. We cannot risk an attack from a witch or wizard. Uh, here is a book with all the info we have on Glenn. You may read it when you have the chance. Yay! Things to read. Always good. Right? Sh surely. Uh, I don't know. Um, you going to give us a book? You going to let me out? You going to... You going to do it? Oh, oh, look. I can't walk out sideways. So, is this the book that I'm supposed to get? Press this when you're ready to go to Glenn's Mansion. 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 Yeah. <laughs> what happens here, mate? Oh, we'll get mashed. Uh, warning. Get a book from the chest before leaving. Hey, top secret. Uh, so, do you trade? Oh, nice. 39. Oh, no. oh he's been traded with. Oh, wait. The, the, the gold on both? I don't know. Anyway, that's not, that's not important. Who cares? Uh, top secret. Glenn Michael Carmel. Planned. John Kennedy died two days after receiving this information. Rip. John Carmel, sorcerer and conjurer, ripping space-time holes, uh, space-time holes that lead to parallel universes. According to observations, Glenn is creating a super portal. I'm sure I came across a super portal in another another map somewhere. Um, uh, all other portals will be moved to into the super portal, creating Glenn's perfect universe. How to stop it? John Kennedy received this information too. The only way to stop a portal from activating is through the power of the Universal Diamonds. Only one that can be only one can be found in the universe. Lucky for us, Glenn has opened portals to many, many universes. So I must infiltrate Glenn's mansion, retrieve many dime, uh, as many Universal Diamonds as possible, and use them to stop the Super Portal from activating. Okay, so that that seems uh, easy enough. We are. What are we going to do? We're going to press the button. <coughs> oh, excuse, ooh, ooh, excuse me. Okay, welcome to Glenn's Front Yard. A non-existent road. Ooh, is a road truly a road if it does not lead anywhere? Ooh, the, see, this, these are the types of maps I like to play. The ones that ask the deep existential questions. Mmm, I like the trees. I like the trees. It's a bit palm tree-y. Do you reckon they just grew this one as it was? Anyway, we're not here to look at tri Oh, jeez. Oh, it's a blaze-headed zombie. Um, oh, oh, well, they told me I'm not supposed to have any weapons, so this is all good. Do you reckon I can kill them and get some, get a weapon? Oh, oh, oh well, this, this escalated quickly, didn't it? Oh, well, I'm out of here. Jesus, look at, look at them all. I mean, they're nice looking. Oh, gee, whoa, no, they're everywhere. They're hideous. And I don't have my zombie crew with me. I mean, how, how am I supposed to survive the zombie apocalypse if I don't have my crew with me? I mean, I'm just oh jeez, I'm just the brains of the operation. I can't, I can't, I can't actually fight zombies. No, jeez, jeez. Well, anyway, this is oh went the wrong way. <laughs> this is exactly what I was after. A nice calming walk through someone's garden. Um, where does the path lead? Oh, it stops. No, it doesn't stop. They really like their uh, the blue orchids here, don't they? Let's, can we grab them? No, we can't. That's a shame. 
that's a shame. Why do I, why do I keep getting little stutters? That's, that's not useful. Anyway, where are we? What are we doing? We are wondering, is time moving on? Is time not moving on? I've, I've picked up quite a, oh, 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 it's a TNT headed zombie. What? Yeah, TNT headed zombie, why not? I mean, who, who, who doesn't allow things like that to happen? Mm. Uh, wow, this path is exceedingly long. This guy must be rich. I mean, like, I used to think he was just like some sort of like idiot villager, but this guy, I mean, look at how long his path is. He's got, he's got to be a millionaire or something, right? I mean, I know my path isn't this long. In fact, I don't have a path. I've just got a set of stairs that lead up to my flat. I mean, <laughs> Are we near the end? Should we start running? Let's start running. Running! I was kind of... It's not even a maze. I don't know. It just seems a bit long. Could I have cut through there? Could I? Oh, no, 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 no. Is that where I came from? Did I come from in there? I don't know. My little internal GPS is not really working all that well. Oh, hello. I could really do with your weapon. No. Are you ever going to drop any of your stuff? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, let's let's carry on running. Uh, he said we're not going to run out of food, so we shouldn't even really need to keep hold of this beef. Uh, beef? Yes, no, this rotten beef. That's exactly what I've got in my hand. Um, so the casting trees are not... Oh, 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 I think we found it. Please, please let me in. The zombies are coming. Oh, oh. Hello? Uh, hello? Uh, oh. Oh, oh, we've got a TNT-headed zombie here. So it took me all night, all night to walk down this path. Oh, i got a potato. Potato. Um, yeah, all night to walk down this path. What's this? Is it a capped well? Do you reckon it's a capped well? I don't know. The house is nice. No windows, I know. No windows. That that could be a little bit... Well, not problematic, but it's a little bit weird. Okay, welcome to his... Well, well, no, well, well, well. I'm surprised the SSS actually started following me. I'm not much of a talker, so I'm going to go straight to, into it and kill you. Goodbye. Oh god, boss fight number one, here comes Glenn. Oh, uh, let's hit him in the face. Does that work? Oh, whoa. 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 Is that what I was supposed to do? You cannot beat me. Feel the burn from my fireballs. That's very no Oh, I missed him. There he is. Right, I, I reckon you take this. Do you reckon we're supposed to fire... The fireballs at him. Do you reckon that that's that's the thing we're supposed to do? No. Take this. The man's children have already gone. Wow, this guy's got a, a weird voice. Bah, this is too easy. You're not even hurting me. Well, I'm trying to hurt you. I don't. I don't really know how. I mean, what's your source of power? Honestly, what is? <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, let's try and. Oh, oh, oh! Fire fireballs at him. Obviously, the way to do it. Let's just keep batting this way. Can, can we use some powers to do that? No, does that not work? Can we can we escape? Is that a thing? Uh, take this. No, no. Um, let's run around a bit more. I'm I'm very close to dead. Um, is there anything up here to look at? No. Oh oh. Uh, the man's children have already gone. You, you just keep looping around. I'm I'm not she. I'm not sure what what I'm supposed to be doing here. I don't think beating him to death is going to win. He seems a little bit invulnerable. Um, I I know. I I wish he'd die already as well. He's just like ah, die already. I'm like no, you die. Oh, it what? No, it's not. A, I don't get it. I um I'm a little bit confused. There's obviously a way that I'm supposed to kill him. I I don't. Oh, oh no! You beat me. Well, I didn't think this is over yet. There's no way you will be able to retrieve the universal diamond. Task complete. Go through the iron doors and find the universal diamond portal. Okay, old chap. That is definitely what I'm going to get onto. Uh, if only my health would come back. Uh, yeah, we've not done too... Oh, there we go. Blink. We're, we're getting a little bit. Uh, these doors open when you have one universal diamond. That's cool. That's cool. What we got up here? Books? No, they're, they're pretty naff books. A large open chest and a small open chest. Look. Oh. Windows. Windows onto the void. Wow, this guy is a true master of his world. I mean... I don't know about you guys, but when I look out the window, I don't see this. Who, who, who would, hey? Who would? Okay, let's go through the portal. <coughs> oh, 
Oh, oh, I walked the wrong way. Right. Hey, what's going on here? Uh, welcome to the Peaceful Plains universe. Yay, Peaceful Plains. Well, I wonder what we're going to find here. But we'll find out next time, I think, because uh, we've been going for long enough for me to go. Thank you very much for joining me for this adventure. I will see you next time when we're going to do this Peaceful Plains universe and get a diamond. Uh, so I'll see you then when we do that. Bye!